Hey guys, welcome to today's video. So my Desium haul has arrived. I have two big boxes here to go through. I'm gonna share everything that I picked up during the sale. If you didn't already know, Desium is hosting their month long Slovember sale. The sale runs from November 1st until December 6th. 23% off both the Ordinary and Neod brands and their newest brand, Lufa. So this is a great time, as you know, to stock up on your favorites and to try some new things. So I'm trying some new things, but I also stocked up on a lot of my holy grails. And on November 1st, I did share the Desium Slovember sale announcement and I shared the top picks and recommendations for that sale. I went into detail for each product and I gave you a little review. So if you wanna check out that video and you haven't seen it yet, I'm gonna leave it below for you for your reference as well as up here because in today's video, I am not going into detail with each product. I am not reviewing it because I've already done it and I have a lot to go through here. So it's just a matter of basically showing you what I picked up and just so that you can see what I purchased. So let's get right into it. Everything will be linked below for you, including US, Canadian, and United Kingdom links. I will also have some additional discount codes in my description box. I recently shared Dermatology's 30% off sale. So if you wanna check out that video, I will leave it below for you also. Please don't forget to subscribe, ring that notification bell, as I would love to have you all here long-term. And please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up as well, as it really does help to support my channel. So how has the sale been going for you guys? Here in Canada on November 1st, nine hours after the sale started, things were selling out already. I could not believe it. I placed my order on November 1st at 12.01 a.m. And when I woke up that morning, I noticed that Neod's facial mist was already sold out. Neod fractionated eye contour concentrate was sold out. I think there was something else as well. And I thought, what the heck is going on? Now, these products do sell out during the Slovember sale, but sometimes it takes a day or two before they are sold out. And then sometimes Desium will replenish throughout the month. But these two products specifically were sold out within nine hours. I mean, it could have been even sold out before then. I was sleeping, so I wouldn't know. But when I woke up, they were gone. And some of you had commented and were like, oh my God, the Neod Mist is already sold out. The eye serum, and I just could not believe it. I've never seen these two products specifically sell out that quickly when a sale has just started. Now, luckily these products have come back in stock since then. I don't know if they are still in stock, but I did share that announcement on my YouTube community tab and I told you that they were back in stock. So if you missed out, pick it up now before it's sold out again. So I was lucky enough to pick up these items at 12.01. That's why I placed my order as soon as possible because I've learned my lesson in past years and I lost out on a lot of products in the past. So the first product that sold out, the Fractionated Eye Contour Concentrate by Neod, I picked up two of them and I was gonna pick up more and I thought, no, let's just pick up two because I have other eye serums in my collection from other brands and I just didn't need to go too overboard because one bottle will actually last a really long time because all you need is one drop for both eyes, sometimes even a half a drop. So a little bit goes a long way and this can last over six months. So I got thinking, if one bottle lasts me six months, the other one is six, you'll bring me back to this time next year. So I just picked up two, and this is a great anti-aging serum to target dark circles, puffiness, fine lines and wrinkles, and it's a must have. I have five Neod Superoxide Dismutase Saccharide Mist that I picked up. I picked up five because this is something that I need to be well stocked up on. You guys know that I use this every day, twice a day. It's one of the best facial mists I have ever used. I haven't found anything like it. It's full of antioxidants, great for signs of aging, great to reduce the look of redness, facial redness, great for providing hydration. It's just amazing all around. So if you love a good facial mist, this really is worth looking into. I also picked up two ordinary resveratrol plus ferulic acids. This is an amazing antioxidant serum. Yes, it's very potent. It's very strong. If you're new to this, start slow, gradually increase your usage because this can tingle. It can cause a little bit of dryness at first, but then once your skin becomes accustomed to it, this is absolutely amazing. Great to 
tackle fine lines and wrinkles, but it also helps to brighten the skin. And you can use this with retinol, tretinoin, your vitamin C serums, and I love it. So I picked up two. It's been a while since I've been really consistent with this, but I plan on being consistent with it now that we're coming into the colder months. So I picked up two. So Neod is currently offering 50% off their multi-molecular hyaluronic complex serum. So I decided to pick up two because honestly, this is one of the best hyaluronic acid serums I've ever used. It contains 15 weights of hyaluronic acids. So this serum is very plumping and very hydrating. And I love using this, especially during the winter months because of how much moisture it provides the skin. So I did pick up three Neod Copper Amino White Slate Serums. If there was a better sale, then I would have picked up more. But I had to pick up at least three because this is one of my go-to copper peptides that I love using. You guys know that I am obsessed with this. And if I don't use vitamin C in my morning routine, I incorporate copper peptides. And when I don't use tretinoin at nighttime, I use copper peptides. So it's always a part of my skincare routine on a weekly basis. And I just love the one from Neod because of how effective it is. Copper peptides can really help to firm the skin and address fine lines and wrinkles. So I picked up three. I picked up four ordinary multi-peptide plus copper peptides, 1%. So when I'm not using the Neod copper, then I am using the ordinary copper. And I love both equally, but I do find that the Neod copper serum works a little bit quicker, but this also provides amazing results. And I love this just as much. I do like to alternate. So sometimes I will use the ordinary. Once it's done, I will move on to Neod. I will kind of alternate like that. But at the end of the day, I do use this one more often because of the affordability and it's very hydrating as well. It does have a different texture than the Neod. This one has more of a jelly texture, whereas Neod is like straight up thin like water. Both absorb into the skin really nicely, but if you have dry skin, I think you will really like this because I do find this to be a little bit more hydrating. I picked up one Ordinary Multi-Peptide Eye Serum. This is wonderful to tackle fine lines and wrinkles, dark circles, and puffiness. Now this isn't quite the same as Neod Fractionated Eye Contour Concentrate. The Neod one is more advanced. There's more ingredients to tackle signs of aging. This one though is still great. It's really affordable and the same amount one little drop for both of your eyes, half a drop if you can do that. This could last six to seven months and it really is effective. I love both, but I do like the Neon one a little bit more, which is why I bought two of them. But this is more affordable, like I said. So if you are looking for a really nice eye serum that can help with signs of aging, the one from The Ordinary is worth looking into. I also picked up two Ordinary Pycnogenols 5%. This is another type of antioxidant from the brand. It's a little bit different from the resveratrol plus ferulic. This will help to brighten your skin and help to protect your skin from free radicals. But the size of this is only 15 mils. So you could go through this pretty quickly, which is why I bought two of them. But I like to put one or two drops of this into my moisturizer, mix it together, and apply it to my skin that way. I feel like if you apply this serum and use it with your moisturizer, this will last a little bit longer. If you use this on its own and you're using like four or five drops at a time, you'll go through it like crazy. So I love this for even added hydration. It really is a great product to use in the winter months. And again, I mix it in with my moisturizer and I will use this morning and or evening. Next is Neod Survival Zero. I just purchased one because this is another antioxidant serum. And honestly, how many antioxidant serums do I really need? But this one from Neod is beautiful and I didn't have any more in my collection. So I really wanted to pick up at least just one. This has a lot of different types of antioxidants in it and this pairs up nicely with vitamin C serums and with the Neod Facial Mist. This trio pairing can really help to brighten the skin, fade discoloration, post acne marks, and it's also very hydrating. So I love this especially for my morning routine, but this is something that you can use every day, twice a day. So I picked up one of these. I picked up one Ordinary Soothing and Barrier Support Serum. This is a must have, especially if you're someone that experiences a compromised skin 
skin barrier or your skin is tight, dry, flaky, it has that burning sensation. This is great to have in your collection for when you need it. Or of course you can use it every day as a preventative, especially if you're just starting out with a tretinoin product, retinol, glycolic, this will save your skin. And you can pair this up with your active ingredients. So I had to pick up at least one because I tend to use this type of product a lot during the winter months. But the reason why I only picked up one is because I also purchased Neod's version of that. So this is the modulating glucosides and I only picked up one of these also because I do have one in my collection already that is still pretty good. So I didn't want to go too overboard here. This isn't pink in color. The ordinary one has that pinky tone, which is coming from the vitamin B12. This has like a beigey yellowy color and it's milky just like the ordinary and it's very soothing on the skin i do find that this one provides more of that instant relief it does work a little bit quicker than the ordinary one but you can't go wrong with either one they're both exceptional to have so yeah, this is a must. I picked up one ordinary glycolipid cream cleanser. I was using this all summer long. It really is a nice nourishing cleanser, but if you have dry skin and it's feeling tight, you're going to love this. This is going to be amazing for the winter. If you have oily skin or combination skin like myself, maybe you're acne prone. I'm very acne prone. This never broke me out. This kept my skin barrier in check and it was just absolutely wonderful. And if you wanna use this to remove your makeup and sunscreen, at the end of the day you could do that so this is a lovely one if you're looking for a good creamy cleanser of course their foaming cleanser is also really nice but I like this one better than the squalene cleanser this is way better in my opinion yes of course I picked up five ordinary amino acids plus b5 to be honest with you I probably should be placing another order and getting another five because this is one of the only products from the ordinary that i am super super consistent with like i use this every day twice a day and i've been talking about this for at least a couple of years you guys know how obsessed i am with the amino acids nobody talks about the ordinary amino acids and i don't understand why because this is a hydrating serum that can be used by the oiliest of skin types to the driest of skin types. Great for all. And I love using this, especially more so during fall, winter, and spring because of how much hydration it provides the skin. And I use it every day. One bottle will actually last me a month, which isn't a lot because I use a full syringe full. I'm very generous when I use this product. So you would probably get longer than a month if you're portioning out your drops, but I just go all in with a full syringe and I just love the way that my skin looks and feels when I do so. So this is really only five months worth, so I really should be placing another order and getting another five. And recently I did share the most underrated products from The Ordinary, so if you wanna check out that video, I will leave it below for you as well as up here, and this is one of those products. So if you're looking for a nice hydrating serum that is super lightweight, thin like water, that doesn't feel greasy or sticky on the skin, this is it, this is a must try. So that is everything that I purchased from The Ordinary and Neod brands. Now moving on to the three products that I picked up from their newest brand, Lufa. So these are the only three products that you can purchase right now. There's still a lot of products that still say coming soon and there will be more hand and body washes, fragrance mist and a body serum and I do believe they will all be in the same sense as these three. So this is going to be a first impressions on these scents. I didn't open these up yet. I wanted to smell them with you basically and I just love fragranced body care products. I know it may not be for everyone. So let's start with the chalk hand and body wash. All of these have jojoba esters and glycerin, so that is great. Of course, I will give you an update on this as I get using them. But the chalk has fragrance notes of crushed mint, fresh saffron, and powdered musk. So let's see. I can smell the mint, but I can also smell the saffron. It's, it's nice. It's refreshing. It has that nice fresh smell. I won't know until I wash my hands with it, but I do like it, but I'm not sure if I love it, but I do like it. We'll see what the other two scents are. Okay, so this one here is the Oud and Amber. So this has notes of Oud, Amber, Bergamot, and Tonka Bean. And I feel like I'm gonna love this based on those notes. So let's see. Yeah, I really like that. It has more of a masculine scent, more of that spice, which I really like. 
So I think Sean will also really like that one as well because of that nice warmth and spiciness to it. So loving that one. I like that one better than the chalk. And this is the Broadleaf Forest. So this has notes of cool cedar, dry patchouli, and warm vetiver. So let's see. This is my favorite. This is my favorite. This you can really smell the cedar and I love that. Perfect for the winter months. Oh, I really like that. You know what this smells like? This actually smells like the, remember the room spray that Decium used to sell? And it's actually the scent that you smell when you walk into the Decium stores. That smells just like this. I love it. I really like that. This is my favorite out of the three, the Broadleaf Forest. So it's got that nice outdoorsy smell, but it has that woodsy and that warmth to it. I like this. I like that one a lot. So I will let you know once I get testing these, how they feel on the hands and of course on the body. But let me know what you have picked up during the Decium sale. Have you shopped the sale yet? Are you still going to be placing a few extra orders? Let me know in that comment section. Of course, if you have any questions, please feel free to ask away. And again, all of these products will be linked below for you for your reference. Don't forget to check out my Dermatology Black Friday sale video. And of course, my top picks and recommendations from the Decium sale if you haven't seen that video yet, which of course, again, will all be linked below for you. Thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. And of course, I will see you all in the next video. Take care and I will see you all then. Bye guys.